In this video, I am going to solve a sample problem about open manometers. Here's the problem. For a gauge pressure at A of negative 10.89 kilopascal, find the specific gravity of the gauge liquid at B in the given figure. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to solve this in two ways. One is to, to sum up pressure, okay? And I will start from A up to this point, no? F open surface. So pressure is gamma times H. Gamma is specific, specific weight of the liquid. And H is height of liquid. So starting from A, we have PA. PA. And then a point A going to the right same elevation same pressure so and pressure sa a same radere and then you go down to point c okay you go down to point c that's plus so gamma gamma of liquid specific gravity 1.6 so gamma of liquid is specific gravity of the liquid times specific weight of water no so gamma and then H. So H is the difference between 3.2 and 2.743. So here's the term. So pressure, pressure at A going to the right, same pressure. You go down, you add gamma H. Okay. Magadka pressure pa going down. So gamma of the liquid. Specific gravity 1.6 times specific weight of water and then H difference in height or distance from uh, this point, this elevation minus elevation to C. So we are now at C and then we now transfer to D. Same pressure, man. Same liquid, same elevation. So, same pressure. So, C transfer to D. And for air, let's assume na constant ang pressure. So, the pressure at D is the same as the pressure at G. So, again, from A, you go down. So, mag-add ka anina term. And then... C transfer to D, same pressure. And with air, pressure at D, same pressure sa G. So we are now at G. And then we go down to E. Last na sad, gamma H. And gamma of this liquid is specific gravity unknown times gamma of water. And then height is difference between 3.429 and 3.048 here's the term so mag add ka specific gravity of the liquid times gamma of water times h difference sa duha so we are now at point e and then we now transfer to f okay so from e we now transfer to f same pressure, okay. From E to F, same liquid, and then same elevation on E and F. So, same pressure. So, all of these terms equate na to sa pressure sa F. Oh. But since open surface, ne, then the pressure at F is zero. Open money. Zero. And the next is we substitute the value of the pressure at A, which is given. And after substitution, you simplify. We can solve for the specific gravity of the liquid at B. So here's the term. Pressure at A, negative 10.9 plus 1.6 times 9.81. The difference is 0.457. And then plus is B, 
times 9.81. The difference is 0.381. So, i-add na combine We have this one. And then transpose. And then divide this factor, this coefficient. And the result is 0.9945. Therefore, the specific gravity of this liquid is 0.9945. We can approximate this one to 1.0. So it probably, this is water with specific gravity of 1.0. So this is the solution when you sum up pressure from A to F. Now, the other solution is uh, summing up pressure head instead of pressure. So, solution two is we sum up pressure head in meters of water. So, recall, okay, pressure is gamma H. So, ang gamma, gamma times H, you can use any liquid. You can compare two liquids actually. So, gamma of liquid one times height of liquid one equal to gamma of liquid two times height of liquid to same pressure. Okay. And the next here is express gamma of the liquid in terms of specific gravity of the liquid times gamma of water, like this one. And then since same lang, we can cancel gamma of water. Okay, so the result is this. <clears throat> now, any liquid. So, for A, we can use this one. We can use water. And then set B, we can use any liquid. So, we can change this one to specific gravity of water times height of water. And specific gravity of any liquid times height of any liquid. Let's change this one. Uh, the advantage here is the specific gravity of water is 1. So therefore, when you add pressure head in your water lang, all you have to do is write H sub W. No need to write SW. Okay, 1 money. So for heights of water, it's height lang. No conversion. Pero pag height sa liquid, you convert ni mo to pressure head in meters of water, then Ang height sa liquid, i-multiply ni mo sa specific gravity of the liquid para ma-convert siya into meters of water. So, uh, one man, you know, and then simplify. Uh, this is the final expression. So, this means na if you consider any liquid, ang height sa liquid, i-multiply ni mo sa specific gravity sa liquid so that converted na siya to height of water. Uh, that's the purpose. So, uh, let's do this. Pressure sa A, of course, pressure head man. So, uh, to solve for H, that's P over gamma. So, the pressure head at A is pressure sa A over gamma of water. No? Okay. Summing up meter pressure head man in meters of water. So the first term is this pressure say over gamma of water. Now <clears throat> from A we move here, same pressure, same elevation, and we go down to C. Okay, we go down to C. Now, since this is not water, then what we'll do is multiply the height of the liquid times the specific gravity of the liquid. So that would be specific gravity 1.6 times height of liquid, which is difference of 3.2 and 2.743. So mag-add ta kay mag go down man ta. So specific gravity times height. Now, from C, we now move to D. Same pressure since same elevation and same liquid. And from D, we move again to G, assuming the constant ang 
pressures of air. So from D, we go to G. And then from G, we go down to E. So mag-add na said. Add o this one. Okay, liquid, liquid beam. Ni. So specific gravity of liquid times height sa liquid. So the distance from G to E is the difference of 3.429 and 3.048. So we are now at E, and then we transfer to F. Same pressure, same, same elevation, and same liquid. And then that's the total. From A to F, so equate nato right side, pressure head sa F, which is pressure sa F over gamma. Okay, so pag sa last part, equate na to sa pressure anang apart. Uh, that's the idea. So, from first point, move up and down, and then last point or last part, equate da yun sa pressure head ana, anang a point. And since open ang kan, surface sa F, open, then ang pressure niya is zero. Zero in a term, no? So after this, we now substitute the pressure at A, which is negative 10.1, and also gamma of water na 9.10.89, uh, and then gamma of water 9.81. And then simplify, and we can solve for S sub B. So the next term is this. Our next expression is this one. 10, negative 10.89 over 9.81 plus 1.6 times the difference of this 0.457 plus S, S sub B times the difference of this, which is 0.381. And then combine these terms. And then transpose, and then after that, you divide in a coefficient 0 0.381. We have this. And the result is 0.9945. So if we check with solution one, it's the same 0.9945. Or we can approximate the specific gravity to 1.0. Or maybe this is water. So it's up to you if you like summing up pressure or either you want to sum up pressure head. So that's it. I hope that you have learned something from this video. And thank you for watching.